Hi everyone, this is Aaron for Zolotech, and we're going to be doing a comparison between the iPad and the iPad 2 and its browser speed. So let's go ahead and first clear the cache of both browsers. That's going to be found under settings. I have it set up here. Clear history, clear cookies, clear cache. We'll do the same on the iPad 1. And we'll use Zolotech to compare. Let's go ahead and go back to the browsers. And I have Apple on here, but let's go to Zolotech. The iPad 1 still feels fairly fast. I'm not sure you're going to notice too much of a difference until you start browsing. So let's go ahead and hit go. Those are saved in my favorites. That's why they're showing up there. I haven't cached them. As you can see, I just emptied it. They just save in your favorites so that they're actually there to instead of having to type it. We're on the same exact Wi-Fi network in the same conditions. And apparently my site is very slow, but there you go. You can see the iPad uh, 2 is loading things a little bit more quickly. And we can scroll. There we go. So it is a little bit faster. We're running the same conditions. We can scroll, pinch to zoom very fast. The iPad 1 is still loading. And now we can scroll fine through both of them. They seem to both be very smooth, no problem there. Let's go ahead and try one more site. We'll try Apple. Now you did see it on the screen before, but I did clear the cache, so that should take care of it. Let's go ahead and try it. Ready? Here we go. There we go, done on the iPad 2. So it is pretty fast. It's not hugely faster, but it is definitely faster. You'll notice a difference, and for those that have to have a speedy web page, it's a little bit quicker. If there's any other comparisons you want to see that I haven't done already, please go ahead and feel free to comment and tell me specifically what you want to see. I'll be doing a lot more comparisons in the future, but thought we would do that first. This is Aaron. I'll see you next time.